part, we will see together how to configure the project. Actually, this is quite easy. All we need to do to, to configure and to use the Angular material is running this command. I'll just zoom in, which is ng add Angular material. And you type enter and like this, all the dependencies for Angular material is gonna will be installed, like uh, as we can see here, and it will uh, automatically install the last, uh, the last version of Angular material. So once this, uh, once the dependencies uh, is uh, are added, uh, I have like uh, a small recommendation for you is will you go automatically to the to the file app.module.ts <clears throat> and to avoid. Uh, to avoid all kinds uh, of errors because uh, that which will say uh, this module is not this module is not defined or uh, null injector exception so I recommend to add all those modules to the to the imports in the app module.ts so like this you can automatically run your application and when you use such a component for example if you want to use the material chips or the date picker and so on and so forth, the dialogue module and so on and so forth. So it's gonna be automatically added and you don't you don't need to, to check the exceptions uh, and all those stuff. So uh, as you know, those part, this part, you can you can find this file and all those imports um, in the project resources and the early or at the beginning of this of this course.